Mm. All right, mm. welcome, welcome everybody. Coach Simone Kelly here, and today we're talking about tips on how to prepare for the 15-day challenge with TLC. Um, as many of you know, um, I was able to lose 15 pounds so far. I'm working on 10 more um, by doing the challenge, and I was not a believer. Like I tell people a lot in the beginning, um, mm -hmm. I've heard about the teas and, you know, you heard people talking about skinny teas, detox teas for, for a long time. And I was like, yeah, yeah, that's cute. That's not going to work for me. And um, thanks to my friend, Tanja. Wave, Tanja. <laughs> Tanja <laughs> actually introduced me, reintroduced me to it and told me, look, girl, just take this, try it. Take the some samples and just try it. And I did it for five days. And the first, I mean, sorry, the first four days, every day I lost a pound in the toilet <laughs> <laughs> so it blew my mind because I was like like you really like this is not possible like how the heck and and the other thing that a lot of people have the misconception is that you're going to be running to the bathroom or you're going to have to be you know, have, mm -hmm. you know diarrhea it's not that type of situation at all um but that blew me away and then you know it just it get, got me gave me a lot of energy as well all the other supplements that came with it um so that really really got me going so um, I had to share this and um, I ended up signing up as a rep because it was just, it's just like a no brainer. Um, and I just really love the product. So I wanted to share tips on how it works and how um, I used it for my own experience and, and also tips from a lot of the other people that were very successful. The first challenge I did wasn't 15 days, it was 12 days. And in 12 days, I was able to see a, a, a four pack under a little layer of fat, <laughs> but I didn't have a four pack before. <laughs> So after 12 and I was like 12 days and um, I don't know if you saw those pictures did you see those pictures Melissa yeah, yeah. it's like just in 12 days so now and then they, they extended it for 14 days but some of the people that were in the challenge their their results were ridiculous like right right um Tanja like like these big yeah. uh fupas hanging over <laughs> yes <laughs> and yes they, they got rid of it it's like how the hell did you do that in 12 days or 15 days so that's what I really, um, I love that it's, it really does inspire people to, to do, you know, knock it out quick. Um, so I'm going to, should I, do you want me to start or do you want to, did you? Yeah, um, start, yeah. So the first tip I want to tell everybody to do, the second you get your product, um, make sure that you weigh yourself, you take a picture of the scale, make sure you, you don't have nothing on, hopefully you don't have nothing on, you don't want to have no heap of clothes on, make sure it's like official. I'm even thinking I need to take a, a pound off because my hair probably weighs like a pound <laughs> <laughs> all those, all those locks that I have. Um, so weigh yourself, measure yourself, and I'm and I mean I I measure my neck, my bust, my stomach, and my waist, and my my hips, and my butt, and each thigh. But some people go they do everything, arms and all that stuff. But you know whatever you think is good for you to measure, that, to measure. Um, the other thing is um, take photos. Oh, I said the photos. Did I say the photos? No, no. photos front, back, side. Have somebody take it of you, preferably. If not, then set up the timer because it's going to be hard to do a selfie from <laughs> all the angles um but it really that alone really um will wake you up because you know seeing the pictures from before and after like when I look back at my yeah. picture I'm like I look like that like I'm like looking at myself like there's no way because you know when you're bigger you don't think you're that big you know <laughs> so it's like it, it kind of blows your mind but the interest for me is what really did it because again we're always obsessed with the scale but I noticed that that my clothes were falling off of me and and, and I might not have been that much lighter but my, my clothes, my inches were definitely shifting. So measuring yourself and try to do it like maybe every week, you know, just to see a difference. Um, so those are the main things you want to do in the beginning. Um, the other thing you want to have set up in advance is a schedule for working out. Don't wait yeah. for the last minute, like, uh, I don't feel like it. Uh, you know, you want to have a 30 minute schedule at least. I, I try to go, you know, if you're not a member of a gym, have some kind of video or something that you can do. Um, I, I like a few. I can send you a couple of videos that I like. We have Marjorie joining us. Um, yoga, strength training, um, anything that you can do that you can do on a regular basis. Um, that, you know, I, I would switch it up. So for me, when I first did it, um, I think I did the regular gym. I did belly dance on YouTube. I did yoga. So you don't have to kill yourself every day. People see me working out and think, oh, I got to do that. I ain't doing that. You don't have to do CrossFit. I like CrossFit. I'm a little hyper. I have a lot of energy. So. <laughs> <laughs> but um there's some people that lost tremendous amount of weight just walking right Tanja yes walking. just walking that's it yeah and, just 30 um, minutes because <laughs> you know how they say it's usually what uh 70 percent is what you eat and the other you know 30 percent is is um the working out it's not all about working out um but I will say adding strength training has tremendously made me burn faster 
And I used mm-hmm. to be afraid of of lifting weights, thinking I was gonna be. I'm thinking I'm thick. I'm gonna look like a like a Hulk or something. And it did the total opposite. I went from a twelve to a ten, and I, now I'm buying mediums. I'm like, oh shit, I'm a medium now. What? Like, <laughs> so it, it's and it's from weight. I know it's from lifting weights too. You know what I mean? Because my muscles um have definitely made me burn fat faster. The other trick is uh, I saw people. I went to Puerto Rico, um, and ate everything in sight. Like I didn't like curb anything. I was just still eating everything. And came back and lost four pounds. I was like, how the hell did I lose four pounds? But I did take the detox tea with me. I only had it maybe a few days during the week, but I think that helps me like, you know, <laughs> mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Stuff. but um, it definitely works. So um, hi, Marjorie. Welcome. Can you talk or you're muted? Oh, she's no, I'm, I, I'm oh, here. Okay. Hey. Okay. Hi. Yeah, you just finished finishing up. Yeah. No, um, I'm still here. I got one under the dryer. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. She's a lactician. That's, and Mar- oh, another classmate. So Marjorie, I've known, this has been a reunion day. Um, <laughs> no, because literally the girl that just left, I did Reiki on, I haven't seen her in like 30 something years. Like she we reconnected with Reiki. Yeah, you'll see if I'll post the testimony later. <laughs> um, so uh, Ms., um, Melissa went to Scanlon with me. Marjorie, I've known since Holy Rosary. So, um, what? <laughs> Wow. I got good energy. I, I, you, can I, me, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I knew little. I knew the little evil Simone. That's the one that I knew. Me? Oh, wow. It was never evil. Oh, um, nah, you was never evil. You've always been sarcastic. <laughs> but that's an airy straight. I was always airy straight. <laughs> All right. So um, the ring leader. So so the the working out for sure. Let me ask you guys. Are you work? Do you have, do you have a workout plan? Do you know what you're gonna do? Marjorie, you already started, right? Walking? You're walking over a bridge. What are you doing? It's it's actually two and a quarter miles one way, two and a quarter back. So we do four and a half miles. Good. Mm-hmm. Every day? You doing every day? Or that's that the plan? Um, no. This this week, because of meetings with her and state survey and me having late hours this week, it wasn't every day. We did two days this week, but normally that has been in the past our almost everyday thing. Okay. So our, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be tomorrow and Sunday that we do the walking, and then we're going to try and at least hit the gym twice a week. I was going to say, um, there's no try. You're going you're gonna to do something. <laughs> you're in the oh, no, definitely, the, right. no, Definitely the walking will be done, okay. but trying to hit the gym, that's getting the schedule together. Gotcha, gotcha. Together, mm-hmm. together. So, so have a, but have a, my point is have a backup plan, like a YouTube video, something you could do for 30 minutes that just says, in case you don't make it to the gym, you know, just make, make something happen. Because at the end of the day, why is it, the reason why it's a challenge is we're going to post what we're doing, you know, whether it's a video or a picture. I need to see some sweat on you in the picture. <laughs> 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 and say, I did it. Because at the end of the day, we're, in, we're encouraging each other. You know, it's not just all about um, winning for ourselves. We want to encourage each other to, to be successful in it. Um, and that's what I think helps it too. Like all, having a whole bunch of people doing it together, it really inspires each other. Um, the other thing you want to plan. Oh, yeah, more people joining. Hey. Um, I will say that NR, NRG pill, <laughs> that sucker's bomb. I didn't, I didn't get to that yeah. yet. Wait, hold, hold up, I'll, I'll, hold, I'll get to that in a minute. I told you. <laughs> I'm mm-hmm. glad. So, 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 just so you know, Melissa, Marjorie didn't start the chat. Um, she's not in the challenge. She just bought the, but she's now because it's. I just created the challenge on the 20th. She'll be able to do it. Um, welcome, John. John is a part of it too. Um, all right, so the other thing, where we got? So the other thing I, I highly recommend, so let me backtrack. So I said, measure yourself, take pictures, weigh yourself, take a picture of that. And we're going to put that in the group. Um, make a schedule to work out, no excuses, have a p- plan B. So if you're not, you can't go to the gym, walk, sh- do yoga, stretch. You don't got to kill yourself every day, but you want to have some kind of action, you know, something moving. Um, what do you do? Um, tell us, Tanja, what you do. You do something with the trampoline? So I do a mini trampoline workout and right now I'm doing the steppers. My, I have to replace my mini trampoline. So okay. however, walking is just as good. It's just 30 minutes minimum of aerobic activity. And right. you know, if you can get in more than 30 minutes, that's even better. Right. That's what I do. Um, <laughs> the other thing <laughs> is to plan ahead um, for your meals. So that's where a lot of us go wrong. Um, where we don't have a backup plan. We're like, oh, shoot, my meeting went over. I don't have nothing to snack on. I'm, I'm losing it. You don't have any nuts, raisins. Um, you know, water is another thing. Um, but, you know, you need to have a backup plan um, so that you don't end up at the drive through <laughs> <laughs> um, And, like, I would even say, like, you know, instead of going to 
Wendy's, go to Panera Bread, get a salad, you know, get, you know, try to, and try to just have healthier alternatives. But if it's better if you can plan out your meals and have the food ready, you know, they say meal, meal plan, and have the food separated already in the fridge ready for the week. Um, that way you're really, you're really good. One of the things that we noticed, there was a girl that lost her stomach was ridiculous in, in 12 days. And she get she drank two gallons of water. I don't know how she did that. I can, I can drink a gallon easily, but two gallons is a lot. But um, you remember that, Tanja? Yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. Water, water <laughs> but, will really help you. It'll help you. Um, also helps you eliminate more. You know what I mean? Because um, mm -hmm. your body is craving it to, to cleanse it, cleanse it out. So um, the other thing I like to add is, and then I'm gonna get into the products after. But I just want to give you these basic tips first because it's really important. Mm -hmm. Um, to have substitutes for certain things. So instead of piling on sugar, you can use agave, stevia, honey, and still be, you know, moderate with your, what you're putting on. Don't go crazy. But, you know, if you have to, if you really need something that's sweet, just use the, um, you know, alternatives. Um, also, instead of rice, white rice, um, try to get like a sweet potato or quinoa. That's what I did. That helped me a lot. Like I would have salmon a lot um, or, or, you know, baked chicken or something like that. Um, cause a lot the misconception is that you have to starve yourself. You don't have to starve yourself. Thank you. Cause there's no way I would do it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um, and, um, definitely try to eat more fish or if, if you can eat like a vegan, go ahead. That would be great. But, um, I'm not, so <laughs> I'll eat more fish and, um, stay away from bread. I mean, a lot of stuff was common sense. We already know this, but I would just say, stay away from bread. Anything that can stop you up, you know, <laughs> you, you want to be as free flowing as possible. Um, if you can, this, this is a tip I've learned from, from other holistic health counselors many times from doing different diets, is always have a big salad every day. No matter what you do, have a big salad um, with, with, your, with your meal. And, you know, make sure that it doesn't, it's not like with a whole bunch of heavy, creamy dressings because people think, oh, I'm having a salad, but the dressing, you got bacon and, uh, you know, what, what, else, what else people put on their salads that make it bad? Like big creamy white um, ranch dressing, you know, like thousand island, like those real thick dressings. <laughs> you might want to just go lighter on the dressing, um, and also have a smoothie uh, if you can, or a green drink or juice um, every day as well. Um, and I'm I'm big on eggs. I love like I I have like hard boiled eggs every after I come back from the gym, like two hard boiled eggs, like the little things that just fill me up. That that's protein that helps me a lot too. Um, you have any tips related to the food um, before I move on? Sandra? Well, I recommend three meals and snacks. So I also recommend having like your dinner for breakfast or lunch. So mm -hmm. I don't stick to what my clients, I do not stick to breakfast food. So that means that if you want to have a steak for breakfast with some vegetables, have a steak for breakfast with vegetables. Have a, If you want a hamburger, like instead of, I'll, when I make a recommendation, I'll say, instead of maybe the sausage, because there's a lot of prepackaged foods that are high in sodium and high in sugar. So you have to be, and they have a lot of added sugars. You have to be very mindful of that. So in addition to that, you know, like the sausages or turkey bacon, right? That's processed food. So maybe instead of having turkey bacon for breakfast, then have ground turkey, make turkey, you can get ground turkey, make turkey burgers, like a patty, almost like a sausage patty. Mm -hmm. So I recommend just staying away from those type of food, prepackaged foods, protein drinks, especially if they have high sugar and high salt. And also the um, turkey bacons, the sausages, just have ground chicken or ground turkey or chicken, bake, make, bake your chicken and just have it for breakfast. So those are alternatives I recommend for breakfast or lunch because sometimes uh, I, I know I, at one point I was in a box where I could only have like dinner food for dinner or lunch food, you know, I couldn't have it for breakfast or lunch. Ha eat whatever you choose to eat, but also I would recommend less carbs. Right. Just, just yeah. less carbs, that's it. And that's what something that you mentioned. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. That, that's, that's one thing that helped me. Um, and I think because also when you drink a lot of water, you're not as hungry too, you know, and if you drink, if you eat really healthy, like I usually have a big lunch, that's like my dinner, I guess, you know. Um, and then I've, what I did when I was doing the, the, the challenge before, I would usually have like a smoothie for dinner instead. Mm -hmm. 
you know, so I'm not going to bed with, with, with a whole bunch of food in my belly. Um, but definitely the big salad and a, and a smoothie, if you can work that into you, you're not going to be as hungry Then you have your one meal, like a, a regular, you know, full meal. Um, the, the other big thing that a lot of people don't know, I mean, they know, but they don't do is write down your meals. Yes. That's where it gets me. Every, I'm talking about anything that goes in your mouth. Like, cause we forget like, oh, that, that, um, extra little cookie I had or that, you know, that candy, like everything counts, you know? So that's why I like loseit.com. If anybody's on that, add me. Loseit.com or myfitnesspal.com. Those are really good um, apps that you can, um, you know, type in what you eat. And then most of the time we eat the same thing a lot, you know, regularly. So once you, once you get the hang of it, it remembers what you eat. So you second you type in E, it'll be like, oh, eggs, you have two horrible eggs. Like you have any more, <laughs> so you just, <laughs> but I like it because it also tracks your calories. It tracks all the, you know, everything. And you can also add in that you worked out and it shows you, you know, how, how much calories you burned and what have you. So I, I really think it's important to get one of those apps. Um, oh, another thing, if you walk, get Runkeeper. Anybody go walking? Um, you guys use the app, Marjorie? I used to use Runkeeper. I keep um, track on my Apple Watch because okay. it stores you have, it. You have the fancy stuff. Okay, whatever. As long as you have something... <laughs> No, because that also gives you, um, you can see how you improve, like if you're walking faster or whatever, yeah. um, and how far you went the last time. I love that. Um, the last thing, um, not the last thing, but one of the things, the biggest thing about the challenge is I would love for everybody to post daily in the group. Because again, it's to encourage each other. We have a Facebook group. So, um, you know, make sure you post a picture. If you want to add on, sometimes you post what you ate. Like, oh, look at the salad I made. It's banging. Check it out, y'all. I mean, we share we share recipes. We might share um, a workout video that we liked or whatever. So just sh don't be shy to share and post things because you're encouraging somebody that might have given up. You know, somebody that might have made some, oh, I've heard every excuse. Oh, work. Oh, I had to do this. Oh, there's no excuse. You can you can do this challenge. I promise you, no matter what, what what's going on in your life. Um, so now let's talk about the product itself. Um, Vanna Black, you mind holding up something? <laughs> <laughs> my Vanna White. Like, which one, yeah, which one would you be talking about first? Nutriburst. Nutriburst is the liquid vitamin. Um, and this actually has been around for 21 years. This is the, the, the number one product um, from TLC. And it's a liquid vitamin. Take a shot of it. You're going to show them how much um, every morning. And I love it because you feel it in your body quick. They say it's equivalent to 10 salads. Um, it has a lot of different nutrients in it. And it tastes good. Uh, to me, it tastes good. Some people say it tastes like tang or whatever, but it tastes good to me. Um, <laughs> so, and you actually feel the difference in 10 minutes in your body. Um, so is it filling? Yeah. Say that Maybe again. Just is it filling? No, it's not like a meal. It's, it's just vitamins. It's just a, it, it goes into your system. It's 98% um, absorption rate, as opposed mm -hmm. to a lot of the vitamins that we take that just, we pee it right out. <laughs> this actually goes into your body. So that's why it's, it's amazing. Um, the pill now, Marjorie, you're going to need your testimonial now. NRG, energy, mm -hmm. what is how you pronounce it? Man. That's the pill. Limitless was the movie. I was, I think I was talking to you, um, Melissa. I can't remember the yeah, name. Yeah. So yeah. I can't remember <laughs> the limitless pill. I'm not even kidding. Like it literally made my brain clear. Like I felt like all the ideas and things I had was like, oh, put that over there. Like I it felt like a whiteboard was being <laughs> sorting out all my craziness in my brain. <laughs> um, yeah. NRG, that's the pill. So, um, and take one, because in the package, it'll have two. I made the mistake the first time. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> I took two back to back. I'm already hyper. Mm -hmm. I don't need extra hyper. Um, mm -hmm. so it, it, and definitely don't take it late at night. Take it in the morning after you have a meal. Um, mm -hmm. but don't take it late. Mm -hmm. it and the good thing is, it's not like, do y'all remember Vibran? Remember, remember them pills we used to take in college? It's not like that. You're not going to be jittery. You don't remember that pill? It's a, they sell it in the, in the coffee in the coffee um in the bodega. <laughs> I remember it. It was like well. an energy pill. It was like like um five hour energy, but it was a pill. Um, that was my favorite pill to go driving long distance. Say that again. So that was my favorite pill to drive long distance. Yeah, it gave me the <laughs> my, my roommate hated when I took it because I would be up cleaning all night, like <laughs> moving things around. <laughs> Well, we took it for, for studying, but um, basically it has the same effect minus the jittery and all that. You have a lot of clarity, a lot of energy, and you want to work out. You're going to want to do something with yourself. You know, mm -hmm. what I mean? um, it helps you get a lot of work done. This one over here is an accountant. She was doing, a, doing, <laughs> Tanja, Tanja's like, I took two. I'm like, Tanja, I don't know how you're taking two. I, I take one and I'm good. I don't need no extra. But um, I think the, between that and then the detox tea, that's the last thing, Tanja. 
my assistant. <laughs> so the IASO T um, is what the magic really, really makes everything move out. So you mm -hmm. take two, not one. So that's one, one mistake I took in the very beginning. I thought you take one because it comes with 30. So remember, it's a 15-day challenge. So take two um, every night. I, it's up to you how you want to do it. If you work from home, I recommend you can do however you want to do it. Um, but if you if you um, want to you know go to the bathroom the second you wake up in the morning, take it at night. Um, you can take it hot or you can take it room temperature or you can take it cold. I personally like to put it in my tea. Like I'll, I'll get a regular tea bag and then put put it in there and then stir it around and then have it with my tea, have it with tea hot because I like the way it feels and it, and it's sweet already so you don't have to um sweeten it and it's sweet sweet and with stevia so everything is all natural there's nothing um unhealthy in there and it tastes good um the fruit punch one I actually like the um what's the one that we like lemon raspberry raspberry um yeah that's a separate one you could buy separately but the 15 day kit doesn't come with that one but either way they taste it tastes good it's like it's like crystal light you know <laughs> it doesn't taste nasty at all um, but that tea, let me tell you, it works, it works, it works. That's all I'm going to tell you. Like you just drop, drop, drop. The, the weight just drops. But again, you have to be doing everything else in conjunction with that. You need to be drinking your water. You need to be eating properly. Um, and it, it, it cleanses you on a cellular level. What else does it do, Tanja? You know a lot more stuff than I do. Right. So the tea, uh, cleans it cleanses you on a cellular level. It's plant-based. It detoxes your kidneys, your liver, and your colon. So my experience with the tea is that it reset my metabolism because most people, the average person is already walking around with 15 to 20 pounds of just waste in their colon. So if your weight is above average, and mine was, then you have already waste in there that has not been released. Okay, so therefore, one of the things that one of the reasons why you experience a weight loss, like you did, Simone, is because waste is also equivalent to weight. Mm -hmm. So when you reduce the waste, when you release the waste, you're going to reduce your weight. Right. So in other words, I was full of shit. <laughs> <laughs> I, can I cuss, um, Marjorie? I'm sorry, you have, you have clients in your chair. My bad. Oh, she, did she mute me? <laughs> no, no, no. They can't hear you. You're in my headphones. Oh, okay, good. I didn't know. I have, That's the way. They, they, they know I have a mouth like a sailor. Yeah, I'm about to say, you're from the Bronx like me, so you can they can handle it. Oh, um, <clears throat> so, yeah, so Shut those, up. <clears throat> those are the... Oh, but you know what, Marjorie? Um, can you now share your experience with the, the energy pill? Because you said you were like, that energy pill, yo. Like, you started talking about it. Tell okay. Me. So the first day I took it, normally when I get home from work, I'm ready for a nap, right? I took it on my day off and I'm waiting for my nap to kick in. There was no nap. Mm -hmm. I was like, the barber at the shop that I'm at every day this week, he's like, what are you doing? Because you're coming in, you're like real lively. Ready like, I'm ready to go. I mm -hmm. wanted to take it like normally, around four or five o'clock, if I have a late night, I want to sleep. Mm -hmm. right. Where's the next client? <laughs> mm -hmm. I really, I really so it has given me energy. Yeah, it gives you, it gives you energy, but it also get, makes you more productive. And it also burns um, calories. Exactly. What is it, 300 calories a pill, each pill? Yes, yeah, so one tablet burns 300 calories. If you have an issue with taking the capsule, you can open it because it's a vegetable capsule and just place it in your drink. You can actually place it in, let's just say your tablespoon of Nutriverse. You can just open it, place it in your Nutriverse and just take it like that, if that's an issue. Okay, I like that trick. Um, or put it in your smoothie, I would say too. That's another little trick you can do. Um, mm -hmm. So yeah, so these are the main, those are the main um, um, ingredients of this detox that makes ma makes magic in Helps you get your sexy back, and um, <laughs> and I, like I said, I I you don't promote stuff. I people know that if I'm promoting them, I must I must be a believer because um, I've seen it work, and it's when been. When you can, you will. Say that again. Oh, that's Marjorie talking to somebody. What'd you say, Marjorie? Oh, she muted. <laughs> um. Oh yeah, that was. I was talking to my client. Got it. Got mm -hmm. it. Um. So what what's your goal? Tell us real quick, Marjorie. What's your weight loss goal for this challenge? Fifteen day challenge. Um, for me, I would probably say I'm not more concerned about weight. I'm more concerned about getting back mm -hmm. active. Okay. 
getting your and energy. yeah, getting my energy back, getting having something to say, yeah, I'm not sleepy, I'm not tired. And Good. that's that was my thing about it. Wonderful. It'll work. It'll work. And just because you're a lactician, FYI, look, well, I'll do the upsell later, but um, they have products for hair as well. Hair and, and actually Tanja joined because of you want to tell them real quick, just real quick, the, like the hair loss situation. Yes. Yeah, so I joined because I had hair loss. So I was under stress. So I had hair loss. And so I was already taking a hair loss vitamin. So it wasn't it wasn't uncommon for me to take vitamins, a hair loss vitamin. So that was the reason why I joined. And I had seen another person, another woman's results. So I said, you know what, why don't I do that? But after taking the hair loss vitamin, I you also was taking a lot of vitamins. <laughs> and that was the other reason because I was taking 20 vitamins during the morning and 20 vitamins in the evening. So in, in the hair loss vitamins was one of the 20. <laughs> so I was taking a lot of vitamins. I like taking supplements, but I have never experienced supplements like these. So one of the things that I just wanted to mention about the Nutriburst, and that is that with the Nutriburst and it being 98% absorption rate, it hits your body basically immediately. So your body doesn't have to break down a pill. And so you'll feel immediate energy. Your cell, the cells of your body will recognize the vitamins and the minerals in the Nutriburst. Wonderful. Um, thank you so much. And then the last thing I want to share, since we have one gentleman on the call, um, can you share, because I know you have some clients that take the, um, that take it, take all the, the, the Nutriburst and all the other things. Isn't there oh, some benefits for men, like um, more vitality, more, um, well, tell me, share, share with us, because I know you always have some juicy fun stories. <laughs> Tanda, anything? Okay, so yeah. So one of the things that I always say for men is that men find that they have more stamina. So John, I'm not sure where you're at with that. <laughs> but one of the things when you take the three products, everyone really should experience more stamina because here's the, the they work in conjunction with each other. So the Nutriburst is going to immediately give your the cells of your body energy and stamina, energy immediately, even before you take the NRG, which mean, which is natural war energy. With the natural war energy, you're going to experience more stamina. That's the reason why Marjorie didn't go to sleep. Now, men say that it also gives them extra stamina. You could take that wherever way you want to. Okay? <laughs> now, I don't know, because here's the thing that... Um, Life. When you get rid of the waste, right? When you get rid of the waste with the tea, everything in your body acts better. It reset my metabolism. Mm -hmm. that definitely so I wasn't, when I started on the hair vitamin, so I was not looking to lose weight. I wasn't using, I could, I could use the weight loss, but I wasn't looking to lose weight. What ended up happening is that my stomach got flat just from taking the tea because I was removing the waste out of my colon, out of my small and my large intestine. It also detoxes your kidneys, your liver, and I was saying, and your colon. So it's pushing waste out. So when are we eat, our, we eat, when we eat food, our body uses the food as energy, but it, our body also, the extra food that it doesn't use is called free radicals. I call it the, so I was, it poops. Our cells poop. How do you get rid of the waste? Because you can't get rid of it by going to the bathroom. You get rid of it through detoxing because it detoxes you from head to toe. Mm -hmm. So I needed to detox from my hair cells, right? I needed it from head to toe because I was really under stress. So what I found was that not only did it reset my metabolism, my hair grew in better. I started having more energy. I started having better mental clarity because that's what the NRG does. So these products work together. Okay. So therefore you will see, you will experience a change pretty immediately. Now, here's the thing. If you continue to eat the way you're eating, your change may be a little slower. Right. So that's why when Simone recommended less carbs, salads, you know, like that's important. Like, so for what I recommend is the carb part, especially if, if a person is potato, rice, 
I recommend carb vegetables, which is cauliflower, corn, instead of, because the corn will give, or carrots, the corn will give a satisfaction similar to a potato or sweet rice. Potato, sweet potato, I think is good too. Well, <laughs> sweet potato, do, do the sweet potato. But what I was saying is that give your body a chance right? Give your body a chance. Like, so if it's white potato, like you say, do sweet potato. Mm -hmm. If it's, if you, if you enjoy sweet potatoes, right? But however, I noticed that for me, the white potato and the rice and the noodles and the pasta, the corn satisfied my craving for that. Mm -hmm. So that was great. So I gave myself a chance to, you know, like let my body reset. Now it reset my metabolism because once you start getting the waste out of your body, everything starts working better in your body. Mm -hmm. I wanna, so I wanna, oh. now the, I just wanted to mention the last thing. I like to take my tea with my dinner either before or right after. I don't wait until 10 o'clock to take my tea. I like to take it with my dinner. So I just wanted to mention that so that I'm ready to have a wonderful bathroom experience in the morning. <laughs> I remember, I she pitched it to me. She said, you're going to have a wonderful bathroom experience in the morning. <laughs> and I, I tell people, you're going to get birth in the toilet. Get ready. Yeah. So it also removes parasites and mucus in our colon. Now, if, if you've ever listened to Dr. Seppi, and I just came across a, bit, a video with Dr. Seppi, most people have parasites from the food that we eat. Parasites are in the food. Parasites and tapeworms are in fish. Parasites are in fish. Parasites are also in, um, you can find them in pork, okay? Also, there's tapeworms in, in our food. We have, there's hormones in chicken and turkey and lamb and beef. There's pesticides. You know everything. The, the air that we breathe is polluted. If you have traffic in wherever time you're in, the air that we breathe is polluted. We, our fruits and vegetables are sprayed, right? So we need to get all of that stuff that they put inside of whether it's the cow or the chicken out of our bodies because we are ingesting it. So I'm not going to go into some um, or into all of that, but I just want to tell you that you will find that those first five days, you're going to five, seven days, watch how lighter you feel, how much better you feel. And then it gets, gets progressively better. And you can't, you know, up to the 15th day, right. Mm -hmm. I promise you guys. So thank you so much for signing up for everybody that's watching this later. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We got to mm -hmm. encourage each other. We got to stay focused and we got to do this and hit our goal. Uh, Melissa, what's your goal? I didn't ask you that because you said you wanted to lose how much in the 15 days. Now let's just get that on. That's record. what I was saying. So like, I don't really know what my goal, like, I don't know what to expect. Even, even so... if a number, like, how do you want to what do you, what would you oh, like? I, wanna, I really want to lose inches because even with the working out, like your weight doesn't matter because mm -hmm. if you gain muscle, you gain weight. So sometimes your weight will go up. <laughs> <laughs> talking about, I didn't have this before y'all. I'm just letting y'all know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I just want to, I just want to lose inches overall. Eventually, like I'm a size 10 now. I want to go to a size eight, like okay. a real mm -hmm. eight. <laughs> So, um, I didn't even have that goal. I think I, my goal was more numbers, like like the weight. Um, but as, and also think about how you want to feel, like how you say. I think you said you you get you you want to get more mental clarity too, right? And be and mm -hmm. so that's another Just big tired. Thing. I'm always really tired. Yeah. Oh yeah yeah yeah. You're gonna get that. You're gonna get that. But what I recommend, Melissa, is that you have a target, even though you want inches, right? Have a target, even if it's five to seven pounds. Just give yourself a target. So here's the thing, because when you don't have a target, then how are you really modifying your? Are you gonna modify it or you not? Because you don't have a target. So if you mm -hmm. say, okay, I'm gonna five to seven pounds, because we have, we we always had a slogan: lose five pounds in five days just on the T, okay? Mm -hmm. But we stopped using that slogan because the FDA was like, well, if somebody doesn't lose five pounds in five days or whatever, like who, you know? So, okay, relax, we won't use it, okay? So here it is, because some people don't modify their diet, but if you commit to this, just like, this is the self-love month, this is the love month. So let's just say self-love, self-love, that's it. Mm -hmm. 
give yourself five to seven pounds. Say, I'm going to do five to seven pounds. That's my commitment to myself. That's my goal. And if you don't do it, it's okay because we're all going to be encouraging each other. But when you have something that you say, I just want to, and then let me see what happens. Okay. And then you can, and then you assess, right? You And so I recommend don't assess yourself at the 15 days, assess yourself every three to five days. What is this working? Is this not working? What do I need to modify? Now for me, like I needed to get off sugar. So I needed to keep assessing it. So like I was saying, the corn really helped with the sugar. The, even though it's sweet, you know, like I was just, I was getting, I mean, I had to really make adjustments because I really sugar and snack food. If that's my thing. So I know instead of snack food, okay, I'll do cashews. I'll do um, fruit, but I have to be careful because it's high sugar in um, my favorite is grapes. So mm -hmm. I had, I had to say apple oranges. That's it. Apples in our, one apple, one orange. So like I said, I do three meals with two snacks. One apple, one orange. I even do an apple with peanut butter as a snack. Or I do an apple with the, with a protein as breakfast, right? So I'll have an apple, but I'll have the protein for breakfast. So there's a lot of ways. So that's what I'm saying. Modify three to five days. Keep modifying just so you can reach your five pound or seven pound goal. But then when you put the question, let's just say in a Facebook group, then like we'll all share and like say, this is what works, right? And we'll comment right. so that because we want you to win. So here's the thing. We want everyone to win. We want you to win. I want you to be your best body. Simone wants you to be your best body, right? And Simone is demonstrating that she, look at how she's transformed her body, right? And not, and it is, and you can do the same. So one of the things that when I was sharing with Simone was that you don't, this is not like anything you've experienced before. Okay. You don't have to now Simone loved to work out. Now she's she's great. <laughs> now I gotta compliment you on that. You are great. But for me, I'm not doing all that jumping around anymore. I used to when I was 20, I used to be a personal trainer and aerobics instructor. Now that was at a time we're all in the same age. So you know what aerobics was like years ago. It was a it was a lot. I don't do that jumping around no more. I mean, I'm doing 30 minutes of low impact and I'm still reducing my weight because these products are working. This is 300 calories, right? This is pushing out the waste, the 15 to 20 pounds of waste already in my body. So they work it together that it's going to be, it's with ease now that I reduce my weight. I don't have to count a calorie. I don't have to really modify my diet. I wanted to get off of sugar. I wanted to get off of junk food. I wanted to be able to control it because it was out of control for me. But now that I have it under control, I can eat it because guess what? When I'm eating that snack food, let's say I eat a bag of potato chips. Guess what? I'm detoxing. I'm <laughs> detoxing. That thing. I'm not. And so it's two teas a night. Yeah. But some people will do three teas. I Listen, think so, but I'm, you know, I will detox it out of my body. Why am I detoxing that? Because I don't want it in. I don't want the sugar or the salt in my body, right? I don't want to keep, like if my mother had pizza, mucus causing things like um, uh, milk, cheese, yeah, yeah. those are mucus causing things. It help, It creates um, arthritis in your joints. It creates mucus in your joints. Mm -hmm. So here's the thing. If I told my mother, my mother had a pizza, I said, make sure you detox, <laughs> make, make sure you detox, detox it right out of your body quickly. So it doesn't even have a chance to sit in your body and start because you detox at a cellular level, your kidneys, your liver, and your colon and the cells of your body. Remember the cells of our body create poops they poop it's called free radicals how do you get the free radicals out you got to detox it out mm -hmm. so if you let's just say you go to the left you go off track make sure you detox let's just say you you had a meal that looked like a thanksgiving dinner while you're in the 15-day challenge detox you're gonna be doing that <laughs> you just say, they can just eat crazy and then just take the tea and then that's it that's, i don't want you that had, i'm just saying that no i'm just saying that be mindful <laughs> that if you go off track get back on track don't right. like not take your products because you got off track. You know how you start a diet, you start doing a weight loss thing and then you got off track. You go, I'll start on Monday. No, keep going that same day. Go, oh, 
I got off track. Okay, let me go get my tea. Let me go make my NRG. Let me go take, and I'm moving forward. Don't stop. Right. Keep going. We got we got to wrap up. We have to stop because we're already over time. But um, Tanja, okay. thank you so much for sharing your tips. <laughs> and um, Marjorie and Melissa, thank you. For, and John, thank you for being here. And I'm excited <laughs> that you, you're all here to do the challenge with me again. I got 10 more pounds I'm going to try to knock out. So, um, you know, we're going to do this and support each other. And I'll see you guys on Facebook in the group. And whoever else is listening and watching this and recording, um, hopefully you will be consistent as well and take some, take down some of these notes and um, stick to it. Make sure you drink water. Get one of these. Water, water, water. We'll save you. All right, guys. Any more last questions? We're good. Marjorie, you good? Yep. All right. Thank you, guys. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Thank you. All right. Bye.